Mr. Shelby. Yes. Peaky Blinders Season 6 Episode 2 added another mystery thanks to Little Ruby's second ominous vision, this time with the Grey Man. Must do something about your wife. But who is it? Animal Kingdom star James Frechville portrays Gina's uncle, Jack Nelson. The sixth and final season of Peaky Blinders is continuing in earnest with its second episode. The installment, titled Black Shirt, sees Tommy Shelby come face to face once again with gangster Alfie Solomons, Tom Hardy, but will he prove to be a friend or a foe? Elsewhere, Tommy is also forced to meet with Sir Oswald Mosley, Sam Claflin, once again, but this time Mosley is flanked by his future wife and fellow fascist lady Diana Mitford, Amber Anderson. The episode follows on from the premiere which saw the emotional tribute to late actress Helen McCrory as viewers finally discovered how fan favorite Polly Gray would be written out of the show. It's both more cautious. During the first episode, Tommy had a tense reunion with his estranged cousin Michael Gray, Finn Cole, in 1933, five years after Michael swore to wreak vengeance on Tommy for the death of Polly. Tommy tried to do business with Michael and his boss, Jack Nelson, also referred to as Uncle Jack. So, who is this new character joining the Peaky Blinders cast, and who will play him in the show? Our business been $5 million for a shipment of powder. Additionally, is Jack based on a historical figure? Here is everything you need to know about Jack Nelson in Peaky Blinders. Jack Nelson is the powerful uncle of Gina Gray, Anya Taylor-Joy, and is the boss of her husband Michael Gray in the United States. He is known in the show for his political connections and large import and export business. Referred to as Uncle Jack in the season 6 premiere, Tommy Shelby met up with associates of Jack Nelson about a potential business opportunity in the aftermath of prohibition ending in the United States. Single one of those cries and I will take him with me. After the talks went down badly, Tommy tricked Michael into carrying opium and then tipped off the police, landing his cousin in prison. Tommy approached Gina with an offer for business with Jack Nelson but got rejected. However, Tommy threatened to do business with Nelson's rivals instead, including the Solomons family in the U.S. Visiting Michael at the end of the episode, Tommy revealed that Jack, his wife, mistress, friend, and son of President Roosevelt and Gina would all be heading to London to do business, leaving Michael enraged. Live more often chosen. Protestants and atheists. Tommy had previously teased that Jack's high society connections and hidden past have made him an influential figure who needs to keep a clean public image. Like minds. Is Jack Nelson based on a real person? Jack Nelson is a fictional character, but Peaky Blinders writer Stephen Knight appears to have taken inspiration from a real-life figure, Joseph P. Kennedy Sr., 1888-1969. That's right, the father of President John F. Kennedy and U.S. Senator Bobby Kennedy, and the patriarch of the Kennedy political dynasty. There are parallels as, like Jack, Joseph Kennedy imported English liquor to the United States after the end of Prohibition and traveled to London with a similar group to Jack's in the show. Stephen Knight initially answered Den of Geek by affirming that Gina was a Kennedy, before clarifying, no, I mean, I'm not giving that away so soon. I have a deal, Mr. Nelson. As ever with Peaky Blinders, you look at history and you take real facts and fictionalize them. There is a resonance with Boston, with senior politicians. What will happen in Peaky Blinders Season 6 Episode 2? I fucked your future husband. So I know lots of things about him. Peaky Blinders Season 6 Episode 2 is titled Black Shirt and features a number of character returns and debuts. The official plot synopsis reads, Tommy gets involved in a power game with fascists, freedom fighters and Boston gangsters. As the players plan to double-cross him, Tommy visits an old ally in Camden. The episode sees the return of Tom Hardy as Alfie Solomons and Sam Claflin as Sir Oswald Mosley, the latter now joined by Amber Anderson as Mosley's lover and future wife, Diana Mitford.